Hello, you're watching the news from Bahrain International. I'm Samar Arjawi. The victorious team of Bahrain clinched their first and second places in the Sheikh Sultan bin Zayed Al Nahyan Endurance Festival, which was held in Budib in the United Arab Emirates for a distance of 104 international kilometers with wide participation. On the occasion, the representative of His Majesty the King for Humanitarian Work and Youth Affairs, His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa, affirmed that this achievement reflects the position of Bahraini endurance in foreign participations and confirms its prestigious position. His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa explained that the achievement of the victorious team is a great motivation to continue reaping foreign achievements in the upcoming posts in the sport of endurance. His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa underlined his keen desire to provide full support to the victorious team in various participations, indicating that the team was keen to participate in the Sheikh Sultan bin Zayed Al Nahyan Endurance Festival. The Rashid Equestrian and Horse Racing Club organized the 18th race meeting of the season held at the club's track in Rafa Sakhir in the presence of a number of their highnesses and representatives of the sponsoring companies. The event was held on the Cups of National Bank of Bahrain, comprising seven races. At the end of the race, trophies were presented to the winners. The Kingdom of Bahrain condemned the launch of a ballistic missile by the Iranian-backed terrorist Houthi militia towards the city of Jezan and a drone towards the city of Khamis Sheikh in the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia in a cowardly terrorist attack targeting civilians. The Ministry of Foreign Affairs praised the readiness and vigilance of the Saudi Royal Air Defense Forces and the coalition forces in supporting legitimacy in Yemen, which intercepted and destroyed the missile and the drone. The ministry affirmed the Kingdom of Bahrain's standing and full solidarity with the brotherly Kingdom of Saudi Arabia and the security measures it takes to deter the terrorist Houthi attacks and protect citizens and residents on its territories. The national vaccination campaign continues to witness a wide turnout of citizens and residents. The Ministry of Health announced that 1,657 had taken the vaccine yesterday, bringing the total number of vaccinated people to 305,619. The ministry renewed its call for the community to commit to all precautionary measures and take the initiative to register for the coronavirus vaccination. And the Ministry of Health said today that the number of coronavirus cases reached 6,739 with 630 recoveries, 588 registered new cases. 215 of the new registered cases are expatriates, 363 are contacts of active cases, and 10 are travel-related. It said that four men, two Bahrainis aged 70 and 71, as well as two expats aged 60 and 53, died yesterday, taking the death toll to 462. The ministry urges everyone to comply with the guidelines issued by the National Task Force for Combating the Coronavirus.